the white whale raid is going so well even at the end when we realize that there's three whales the fact that like this is our first run ever if you've ever raided in an mmo it's kind of crazy to make it this far i thought that we would take a couple runs to get here but it also doesn't make sense to what are you gonna do keep reanimating like all the scenes that you show wilhelm versus the white whale in the next runs too i guess it doesn't really make sense so i could totally see us clearing this in the first pass wilhelm von austria lived up to the hype bro literally 1v1 <laughs> the whale i know there's support happening but i think in a dps parse he's doing majority of the work the way he just like stabs the whale runs around jumps off ricardo's ready with the blade side to launch wilhelm again bro literally flies like a fucking rocket gets the whale's eyes out bro is so peak how is a swordsman gonna fight a flying whale and that's the way it's gonna be what did we learn we learned that the white whale has many different attacks the fog attack is what erases people he has like this like um screeching ability that creates a debuff and if you have some mental resistance then you're good against it maybe subaru has built up that resistance throughout the past runs of mental sanity or it's the witch's miasma that's actually helping him we use the aoe taunt again and this time satala graces us with her purple lipstick we're getting really close to see what she actually looks like so far it's just been the hands but this time it was like her lips and what did she say she said I love Satala is what you should have said. Rem sucks. Amelia sucks. Now, at the very end, right? Phase 2 was hard. It looking like Wilhelm died. I don't believe it. I don't believe Wilhelm that I could totally see him just getting out of the fucking whale, like cutting the insides out. Ricardo? I'm not sure if he dodged it. If you saw my analysis, the Riger that Ricardo was riding got split in half, but I didn't see Ricardo's body, so maybe he's still alive. There are three fucking whales we have to deal with. I'm at a wit's end as to what's gonna happen. Is Roswell gonna show up? Is Reinhardt gonna come back from his lolly photo shoot with Felt to save us? Let's begin today's reaction. Three whales, bro. What are we gonna do, Mimi? Ricardo, where are you at? Oh, the team morale is low. I mean, do you blame them, right? It took this much effort for one whale, and you see three motherfuckers now? Yeah, I would lose the morale too. <laughs> Ricardo! Okay! So... I don't know the rest of his body, he's bleeding, but maybe he's not dead. Okay, okay. Subaru! Well, help! A lot, Subaru! My hero! My head cannon as Rem did that specifically so that she could get caught by like a prince like this. And she's like a princess, like a damsel in distress. So, sound like Wilhelm is inside, right? If we free him before we get swallowed, we can save him. <laughs> Damn. True leader right now. Remember, giving up is easy. No, giving up is so hard. Remember all that dialogue, bro? The one person right now, just like the pinnacle of a leader to raise team morale when everyone gave up. It's Natsuki Subaru, man. Yo, respect. Opening or no opening? No opening. All right. Land Dragon has a name now? Patrashi, okay. Patrashi, Land Dragon, the really prideful one that Rem is now competing. Just remember that your favorite girl, Rem, is literally competing against a Land Dragon for Subaru's affection. And there's also Petra, too. Just don't. I, I, want you, I, I wonder where Petra is in the fucking pecking order, bro. <laughs> She getting too fucking comfortable, man. <laughs> Inside the whale. I'm gonna assume that the whale that Rem is attacking is the one that Wilhelm is inside right now. Yeah, there's three whales. That's weird. Yeah, where did that whales come from? How could we not know that by now? Because they all look the same as triplet whales. But it is crazy. For 400 years, no one ever saw the other whale sightings. 
what does this mean? They're fake whales? This is technically an illusion? Like, are we being gaslit right now? I don't know. What are you implying? Fake whales? Fake whales, baby? You know what? The more I think about it, maybe the white whale is also in its last stand right now. And even though it looks like it's overwhelming a 3v1, this is like its last desperate play to have like these other quote unquote whales show up, even though it's just all just like a bluff. <laughs> What's the plan? Where's the fire? <laughs> Fucking useless, but hey, it is what it is, right? They're they're all they got the weak they, they got weak mental power, right? They cannot stand up to the whales conquerors hockey. Fine, I'll do it myself. Oh she's spamming that sword. Let's go, Patrash! Dude, Patrash is dodging so well! Doesn't matter if you seal the holes. What else do we do? What is the condition? What is the fucking trick? Mimi! Clutch Mimi! Hetaro Mimi just saved us! Yeah, Anastasia's private army is fucking goaded. They have been very, very useful. Crucia's army, they are right. Man, Crucia's really spamming the fuck out of that sword. I don't know how many times. I thought there was like some sort of cooldown or something, but she's just spamming that shit. Okay, Ricardo's not dead. Okay, Ricardo, good. Good job, Mimi. Message. <laughs> nice impression, Mimi. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, Hetaro. That was Hetaro, my bad. That was Hetaro's impression of Ricardo. Lighter. What got lighter? The whale? The blood loss? Light? Light. Light. Light, if we have light, these are all illusions. Light, what, what does the light do? Light, how does this work? Light, light, darkness, light. <gasps> do we have another night banisher around? It's, I'm not sure if we're talking about the properties of light or if we're talking about the weight of the whales right now. Hmm. It's heavy, it's not heavy. What does that mean? Like, does that mean that the original whale is lighter because it's split into three separate smaller whales? I don't know. I don't understand. Let's go, Red. Will help. Will help. Will help. Get out of there, my man. Yeah. Fuck yes. So my man's still fucking alive after all the death legs. Now. Let's not jinx ourselves, but I need this guy to live this. Giga hell! Are you good to fight? Don't be on your deathbed now. Oh shit, he passed out. Get him to Felix! Get him to Felix right now! Yup, yup, yup. We have a plan about the weight, light of the whale, darkness. I don't know. Ew. Am I mean? I don't know. I, I'm just so used to Mimi and Hetaro that this other Anastasia army guy just. Ew. It divided. So it is just the big one split into three? Okay, okay. I don't know. This is still true, what she's saying. Kill the main one, then everyone else dies? Is that the gimmick? The main one is very up high. Okay. Get the real one, everything else dies. What a strategist. What was the lore of the Phantom Sword? It has no regard for range. The almighty range sword. I cannot rely on my sword to hit from this bitch. Your sword is a fucking fraudulent scam. Cause it'll miss? I saw this bitch just fucking swing it all the time! <sighs> Alright, it's gonna miss. Fine, it'll reach it, but it'll miss. What the fuck is the point if you can hit that far away, but you'll miss? One strike? 
Basically, startle it. Stun the whale. Hit it once, get it stopped moving around. Crucius Blade will reach it. It's the accuracy we're talking about. The range is not fraudulent, it's the accuracy. Gamba time? I'm down the Gamba. It's just, I can return by death. Taunt. All the whales get enraged. They kind of stop for a moment. Shoot? I don't know. Look at that, man. Fist bump with Wilhelm, fist bump with Krush, and imagine the amount of respect right now we're earning from Krush, right? Krush must see us in a much better light than before. Like, everything we're doing, especially if we actually defeat this raid, like, if, if this raid is successful, Subaru's heroism is gonna go down as a fucking local legend. <laughs> That's so ballsy, man. If that fall hit, if that fall hit, bro. Look at the leader in the front line. Giga Krush. Speech time. Speech time. Speech time while shitting on Subaru because if someone as weak and pathetic as Subaru can, you know, still fight, what are you doing on your asses right now? Be inspired by him! Okay, I, I get it! I, I get it! Wow, she really digging this in. He is so weak! Look, my men! Look how pathetic he is running away! So ugly! Powerless! But look, he's desperately struggling! And remember, he's so weak! True. True. That's right. Get inspired. <laughs> Oh no, that was not Rem, it was a different weapon! Oh, Baldi! Yo, Boomer Squad just got a hit in! Nice hit! Krush's ability, Krush is honestly such a natural born leader, man. Like, do you think Amelia could give this kind of speech? I don't think Amelia needs to. Krush is like, like a general on the field. Like, she is so based. The more I see of Krush, the more I like her. She's one of my favorite candidates, right? Her weapon is sick. Her ability to lead and inspire her men is sick. She stands on the fucking front lines as a leader. She's sick. What the fuck's Priscilla doing right now? Watching this shit from a TV? <laughs> <laughs> the top wheel. Rem Ah, missed. It's not part of the plan. Yo, Subaru. Subaru. Get sent with the Alhuma? Why is he talking right now? Did, did he fly? Was Subaru on Alhuma? I don't know what's going on. Did he? Was that the gamble? What? What? Man, this is my Subaru, yep. This is the hero, Natsuki Subaru. The peak Subaru that we know from Arc 2. The one that was also so confident in Arc 1. This is when he is so fucking good, right? This is prime Subaru right now. You jump off, then say I can return from that? Is that the plan? Satella! Oh, wait, 
this time she's not wearing the purple lipstick. I guess last time she wanted to really make a good impression and then she, you know, wiped off her makeup and now she's back. What did she say this time? Rem's still trash. Ram is better. I love Satala. Emilia sucks. What is she saying this time? Who knows? Oh! Okay. Yo, look at that aura. You can see the miasma emanating off of him. Titties. <laughs> right back at ya. Hold up. We caught her like a princess last time, and this time she caught us. Whoa. <laughs> what? What do you say? <laughs> you saved me. <laughs> Thank you for the treat. This is the treat, but obviously Subaru can't recognize that because he doesn't see Rem as a fucking romantic interest. <laughs> I, in my head canon, Patrash, his eyes right now, is looking back. Patrash is giving the biggest side eye right now. Patrash is upset that Rem is getting a little action with Subaru. That's my head canon. Right now. Have some pride! That's right, Dragon Pride! You're gonna blow up the flugel tree? I, 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 I thought this is like an important landmark, so we're gonna make the tree fall down on the whale? Wow! White whale subjugated! Oh, the flowers that, you know, uh, fucking, uh, what, what's her name? Right? Wilhelm's wife loves, but uh, what? Dude, the accuracy. The accuracy to land this shit? Like, that's, that's pretty impressive. Imagine you fucked up this. Yeah, Teresia's flowers. Teresia's flowers blossoming, bro. Look at these petals. This is, this is cinema. Oh my god. The final strike. Left for the man who has the biggest reason to slay the white whale with the flowers literally in his face. Oh my god. End him. End him, Wilhelm. Oh, more backstory? <laughs> Wilhelm? This is when he's about to take the Sword Saint title away? <laughs> Soundtrack, man. He and he took it from her because she never wanted it. I will. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, first of all, where the fuck is the rose petals fucking? <laughs> okay, this is inside the palace. Where the hell is this flower blossoms coming from? Who cares? I do love flowers now, yes. For you. For you. Wilhelm is such a giga chap. Oh my god, this is getting me teary eyed, man. <sighs> Wilhelm's such a fucking good character. Such a good question. Uh, such a good character. I love Amelia. <laughs> say it. Say it. Someday I'll say it. Alright, we'll save the love for later. <laughs> Ricardo's good. The final strike. Like a puck said. Sun rises just right on time. This is so good. 14 years in the making, dude. I did it for you. There's no way. You never said I love you until now. There's no way. 
He never said it when she was alive. <laughs> this is sad and funny at the same time. Oh my god, dude. He finally says it though. He finally says it, and we heard it. We heard it, bro. This is so peak. Oh my god, Wilhelm is actually such a good character. I love this dude. This guy survived 14 years of revenge in the fucking making. Finally slayed. Then says, I love you. Let's go, we did it! Dude, 400 years! <laughs> this is mad hype. Bro, four fucking centuries. And again, first run two. It is insane what we have just done. Wilhelm takes the credit. Of course he does. But, dude, the heroic tales of Natsuki Subaru who made this all happen? It's gonna go down centuries. <laughs> Head cannon, Rem is perfectly fine, is not weak, is acting weak so that she can be like this in Subaru's lap. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Two flowers blossomed. This to represent Teresia and Wilhelm? I don't know. Dude, we're, this is amazing. The sun is rising, everything is good. This is so triumphant. Everyone lived, except NPC casualties. Yeah. That's war, though. <laughs> nah, super, you're popular. <laughs> Amelia just gets so mad because we just like bolstered Crucius fame and being Dragon Kingdom Luganica. That's right, we just slayed the White Whale. Holy shit, what have we done? What have we done? <laughs> what have we done? <laughs> well, it's that or she dies. It's, it's that or she dies. What do you want us to do, bro? I, I mean, fuck. It's, it's not like Cruz gets all the credit, right? Natsuki Subaru does too. I mean, if anything, I feel like Natsuki Subaru, who is on the side of Amelia, getting this credit is also a good thing. <laughs> AU, hero. AU, bro. You're an actual hero, bro. Dude, and don't fucking tell me that Subaru did nothing in this fucking war, man. He immediately launched in. He set everything up to happen. He used in a self bait multiple times. Figured out. He named the fucking fog. Figured that out. Figured out the fucking mental distortion shit, told Felix what to do. Went on to encourage people when everyone's team morale was down because there was three whales. Continued to go in, was used, under, thrown under the bus by Cruz for an inspirational speech. Took a fucking gamble, rolled Al Shuma all the way up there, and then landed, fell down, returned by that dude. This guy, again, without battling, he has done so much. Like, the ultimate fucking support. Strategist. Support, utility, my man is on another level. The tree shit too, that too, man. And Patrash also gets a lot of credit. Patrash let this all happen. I think all the dragon mounts, all the rigers, all the mounts, they clutch too. <laughs> it has. You deserve this. Amen. With Amelia. Wow. What a line. What a fucking declaration. To another role candidate right here. I'll make Amelia the ruler. Chills, brother. Okay. It's what I want to do. Not for anyone's sake. He's being honest. It's what I want to do. Respect, for sure. Go do it. Did we just reject Krush? We just reject Krush, huh? Straight up. This dude rejected our old candidate, man. Oh my god. Yeah, I think we can. This is a beautiful alliance friendship in the making, man. Nice. <sighs> I 
And imagine what Wilhelm is thinking too. Dude, a royal candidate is saying, I shall not forget the debt I have incurred this day. Man, the lows are really low when we fuck up in the different runs and lose their trust and burn their bridges. But the highs are just as high when we just approach everything correctly. She feels the need to debt, bro. <laughs> And, we, and again, remember when we told Amelia, and that was more of a projection of like, you have such a debt that you could never fucking pay back. We don't even need to do that. When you act properly, when you understand how to, you know, make other people work with you and stuff like that, she's literally saying, I have a debt that I could never pay back. I will be your friend no matter what. It's a little bit of an overgeneralization, but you know what I mean. Yeah, you're going to be on my side. Damn. That's hype. Number one and two, my heart. Wait, 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 wait. Number one is obviously Amelia. Number two, uh. Patra? <laughs> it's Rem, it's Rem, right? It's Rem. <laughs> it's gotta be Rem. There's no way Rem is not number two. It's gotta be Rem, right? Ain't no way y'all are fucking saying Patra right now. You motherfuckers. Number two is Petra. Come on, guys. Number two is Petra, and then it's Patrash, and then it's Rem. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rem Glazers. I love Rem. I love Rem. <laughs> I have not gone so far as to think of it as a woman, my... Mm -mm. But not yet. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> I mean, I mean, not right now. Right now, right now. But... But maybe a little heartstring was tugged. Nice. Handshake. Call it a day. Beautiful alliance. Beautiful friendship. Dub raid. Happy ending. Are we gonna eat the whale now? Can we eat the whale? That's right. The road's cleared up now. We can get to the mansion faster than before. We can get there before the cult gets there. We can plan ahead, right? The whole point of the subjugation was because in the previous runs, right? We were always too low, slow to get there because that one time we brute forced and the whale was there. Now we can get there early today. Yep. This is a stepping stone. Yeah. Mm. Wilhelm? Are you going to swear your allegiance, bro? Are you going to say, for allow me closure for 14 years? I pledge myself to you, Subaru, please. Natsuki Subaru de. Oh! Yep. This is crazy, bro. A royal candidate and a Von Austria on his fucking knees with the sun glowing. He is a hero. Subaru straight up is a hero right now. Look at how it's crazy the position we're in compared to a couple episodes ago. From the bottom of my heart. True. Wow. My man saying, oh, don't stop. Yeah, I'm that great. No. So humble. No, Wilhelm. It was all you, man. Look at that. You clutch, bro. Mm -hmm. Yes, I loved her. And remember, Wilhelm honestly owes us his life. Because, like, everyone gave up when Wilhelm got swallowed up. Super was the only one to say, we can still save him right now. Rem went, Rem was doing crazy shit on that whale. Literally, thanks to us, Wilhelm is also alive. You're giving us your army? Okay. We can go to the mansion with them? Wow. This is such a happy ending, man. What? Rem benched? Okay, maybe Rem wasn't faking it, guys. Well, maybe this is faking it right here. I don't know. <laughs> this slightly is, is she faking it? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Rem getting cooked again. <sighs> Rem's so good, man. True. So much, man. I'll help you this time, Rem. Alright.
you'll still keep me by your side? Well, if that means that you'll be my side hoe. Yes, man. You are just gonna be on the side. This is true. I'm the one who should be begging you to. This is absolutely correct. Absolutely. Okay. Uh oh, she got us. True. And he has awakened as the hero, this whole thing. From rock bottom, Rem built him up saying, The way you perceive yourself is trash. I think you're my hero. Now he is literally a fucking hero. Subjugation to White Rose, four centuries of oppression. He fucking solved that. There it is again, demonically possessed. Delays, Rem. Let's go. <laughs> so close. It'd be funny if Rem was like head but head to head, and Rem's like, and Subaru backs off for some shit. <laughs> like, try to sneak one in, huh? This, you're so close. Just, just, come on, just. just. <laughs> Ricardo's still a good man. Mimi felt good. He did. Is he? Hetero's impression was good though. So like, remaining army, we can take you? Like, like we can straight up take them to the mansion and they can help us fight against the fucking cult? Yo, everything is working so perfect. Every, it's, it's like worrying me, you know? I, I think Crucius' army is 20, but obviously, you know, the other side of Anastasia's private army, there's more than 20 there, right? If, if you add them all together. But, like, things are going a little bit too good, you know what I mean? Like, like things are going way too good. I'm getting a little paranoid now. Alright, Ricardo. Take down the Archbishop? Yeah. They? They? Julius! Julius is coming? He gonna help us too? Lucky motherfuckers. Julius. Ah, okay. There's Mimi, TV, Hetaro. Okay, okay. Mimi, TV, Hetaro. Subaru, careful. Don't fuck this up with Julius, please. He's a good guy. Subaru, please don't fuck this up for me. I knew why he's doing this, but I thought that he would have been a little bit more corrected by now, but hey. Let him cook. Maybe they need to have talk it out. <laughs> oh, fuck, that, that last line from Subaru. Oh my god, the wrath is back. <laughs> a wager that defies despair. Yeah, the Gamba, right? The Gamba that defies despair because of how truly insane the plan was. And that, my friends, is the end. Of the whale subjugation. Fucking crazy. We beat this shit one run. I think it goes to show how powerful Wilhelm von Austria is. This is such a fantastic episode. Not only was Wilhelm popping off, Subaru again literally was the only one that was willing to go in and encourage everyone to not give up. This dude that can't fight for shit, that's a support utility, is still in there. Managed to fucking rescue Wilhelm. Everyone gave up. Super was the only one that was still fucking in it, man. Like, his potential to be a leader, strategist, I already see it, man. It's fucking amazing. Krush definitely went crazy. Rem went crazy as well. Apparently, Rem actually took all the damage when the tree fell. That's why she's so injured right now and protect the Subaru, but the enemy didn't really show us that. And the madness that is fucking him literally riding up with Al Huma. Go all the way up, comes here to the main whale while everyone else is distracted thanks to our different squads, jumps down, uses the AoE taunt again, which shows up, and then it creates a reason for the whale to get distracted, we pin him down, the tree fucking falls down. Just genius strategy. Genius fucking strategy. Big brain. A 17-year-old kid is doing this.
what the fuck are you even doing at 17? <laughs> Sorry, this is a pointless comparison to make, but it is crazy. Natsuki Subaru is not an ordinary human. This guy is fucking insane, dude. I'm actually underestimating how smart he can be. The whole Teresia and Wilhelm backstory, fantastic. I loved how the ending here, as, you know, the whale is down and everyone clears out. The flower petals are moving, the ones that Teresia loved. Wilhelm shows up and the events literally lining up with the backstory. The amount of romance, bro. He literally became stronger to take the Sword Saint title away from her because she never wanted it. But then he never said, I love you. Bro, how old is Wilhelm? Let me think about it. 70 years old. Let's assume Wilhelm is 70 years old. That means, un like, until he, if at age 56, Teresa was taken away. His ass probably here fucking 20. So minimum, like, 30 plus years, this motherfucker never said I loved you. He never said I loved you. And he saved it for this one moment. And in terms of content, right, of course this is so impactful to us, right? In terms of having a triumphant ending, something so poetic, this I love you at the end as he slays the whale is perfect. But if you think about it, this dude didn't say I love you a single time. Oh my god, bro. That shit's fucking killing me. But it was so beautiful. And then, reaping the benefits, right? Reaping what we sown. Subaru has accomplished so much. He's, you know, he's Remember, just how important four centuries of oppression this whale hunt has been. Krush is so in. Krush respects Subaru from the bottom of her heart. Even if we're on opposing side, I will always show you favor. I will always be friendly with you. And yes, we didn't completely riz her up, but the heartstrings were being tugged, so... So far, we've rizzed up Emilia sometimes. Yeah, there's a lot of cringe, but we, we've rizzed up... There's sometimes we rizz up Emilia. Krush has been rizzed, sometimes. Priscilla, the Appa moments, I still think that was a little bit of a riz. Maybe I'm reaching there, but... And Felt? Maybe there is some time, so only Anastasia's love. I mean, he's doing pretty well with every fucking candidates, man. And then it's not just Krush. Wilhelm gets on one fucking knee. One knee saying, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Bro is going with us to the fucking mansion, bro. He's gonna help us fight against Betelgeuse. This is so fucking peak. And yes, Rem might be benched right now. But hey, we are Rem's hero. We're gonna fucking take care of everything. And things are looking so good. Until Yulia showed up. Everything was so good until we saw the fucking wrathful look we see in Super. Whenever he, you know, makes this face, I'm always like, oh, dude, come on. He's a good guy. Maybe we can talk it out. Maybe we can talk it out. Things are good. That's it for me. If you're still here, though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.